Does your computer run slowly? Yes? Well, you need more RAM. And I'm going to show you how to install it. This is desktop RAM. It's an old desktop RAM. It's DDR2 800s. You can tell that by the KVR 800 next to it. Standing for Kingston Valley RAM. 800 and it's got some timings there and it's 2 gigabytes as it says after the slash running at 1.8 volts now this is new RAM this is a 4 gig stick see what I'm going to be putting in my machine see Corsair value select RAM I'm not even sure what those stand for but anyway let's get on to how to install it you've got two, four clips either side of the RAM but I'm going to put two sticks in so obviously the four clips I need to undo Undo those, take your RAM out of your packaging, do not touch the contacts. Grab it either end, I tend to grab it. Now you need to align the key in the middle. You notice there's a slot in the middle which also matches the slot on your motherboard. Now remember that each motherboard only takes a specific type of RAM. To look this up, you go to your motherboard's manufacturer's website and see what RAM it takes. Now you heard two clips there, they were the clips copied down on the side of the RAM, fits into slots ready for it. Now here's a demonstration of the key I talked about earlier. You can see it's the slot in the middle aligns with the slot on the motherboard. It's just so you can't put them in backwards and ruin the system. So once they're in, you press down. There we go. Your RAM is installed. And if you want cool RAM like mine, this is the Corsair Dominator. It fits on the side of your RAM, on the top, both clips, and, well, blows air onto them. It's a RAM cooler. It's excellent. You can see that dust line on my CPU heatsink where the fan used to be. And now it's back, it's covered. So when you turn the computer on, you need to look out for your BIOS. You see it's underclocked my RAM because it's got confused. But you can see here, I have 16GB of RAM in there now. And you'll upgrade to whatever you want. And here it is in Windows, just to confirm. Now I know what you're saying. You're saying, I've got a laptop, what do I do? Well, this is laptop RAM. It's a lot smaller than desktop RAM. And this is how to install it. You slot it in at about 45 degree angle push it in and then you push it down flat and that's it it's very easy thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe get some